Picky Nicky by Kathy East Dubowski, illustrated by Mark Dubowski. Hello, everybody. Today we're going to read a story about a little girl. Her name is Picky Nicky. Picky Nicky is very picky. She only wants to eat spaghetti. Let's see how Picky Nicky learns to eat other foods too. You can follow along if you'd like to, and remember to turn the page when you hear this sound. Now open your book to the beginning of the story. Are you ready? Good. Mom and Dad say supper is ready. Picky Nicky says, "I want spaghetti." Mom says, "No spaghetti." We are having peas and carrots. Picky Nicky says, "I would rather eat bees and parrots than peas and." Carrots. Dad says we are also having grapes and pears. Picky Nicky says I would rather eat apes and bears than grapes and pears. Picky Nicky says, "Freddy always has spaghetti." Dad says, "Then go eat at Freddy's house." So Picky Nicky goes to Freddy's house. She goes to the door. She rings the bell. What's for supper? She says, "It's spaghetti." Says Freddy, "Get a plate." Freddy's mom brings the spaghetti. Then she says. We are also having peas, carrots, grapes, and pears. Pass your plate. Oh no! Picky Nicky thinks I would rather eat bees. Carrots, apes, and bears. Then peas, carrots, grapes, and pears. What will she do? I know. Picky Nicky takes a. Spoon of peas, a spoon of carrots, some grapes, and a little bit of pear. She hides them under her spaghetti. Soon her plate is clean. Where are the Peas, carrots, grapes, and pears. Wow! Picky Nicky ate them.
The next night, Picky Nicky says, "I will eat anything if I can hide it in spaghetti." Dad says, "Even peas, carrots, grapes, and pears, even ice cream." Picky Nicky says, "No, I will have my ice cream all by itself."